Good afternoon, everyone. How are we all doing? This is Florida Supreme, and we are here at Disney Springs. It is very packed. It's the weekend, the last Saturday of spring break, but for some people, it's the first. It's actually a little chilly tonight. It's very windy. I think it's 60 degrees, and good thing I got my long sleeves, but wow, wasn't expecting that. I haven't been to Disney Springs in a long time since I got my Universal Annual Pass, but I am glad to be back after a whole month. Everything looks super great. Uh, the crowds look very happy, and we're probably gonna get a bite to eat <laughs> because I haven't ate all day, and there are a lot of opportunities here at the Disney Springs. All right, we're gonna check out Maria and Enzo's Restaurante Pizzeria. Hey, all, she, all she's got wow, to say is her, her, her ex. So, I actually never been inside this place before. You go order by the slice or get a box. All right, you have a lot of choices like pepperoni, big Roman. Ooh, yeah, a lot of good choices. Um, they have some salad and sandwiches options. And over here, you got some dessert options. It looks like you could get cannoli, tiramisu, chocolate cake. Take a look at that. That's amazing. It's actually a pretty long line, so I might not be eating here, but it's really cool to check out new things here. Because there's a lot of hidden places to eat. Here is in our entrance to Maria and Enzo's. This is the more fancier restaurant. Wow, we saw the fast food. Wow, look at the details and artwork up there. Have a lot of different locations. You got a lot of retro posters. It's very fancy and you have a big globe on the top. So this place is the Edison. Um, it's also a really unique restaurant. You have a lot of good options, like there's this cool unique item where they have bacon on a clothespin, but they also have a lot of other cool themed food. They have also really good drinks, burgers, and all that. Really cool, I can't wait to eat here one day. All right, this is the new Gideon's Bakehouse. It's like a gothic bakehouse. It has cookies, cakes. Uh, actually, it's so tight in there that they only allow an exclusive amount of people, kind of like a nightclub. <laughs> See, the doors are closed, and every once in a while, they bring someone in. But right now, the line is super long, and it's probably gonna be really hard to get in right now. So, we're gonna skip it today, but it's just really curious to see it in person because I've been seeing a lot of people go there. The line starts here, and it's all the way over there. That just shows you how long it is. This place is actually where I went for my last birthday. It was really good. I got the fish and chips, of course. The line is extreme today. You definitely have to book it pretty much like the morning or the day before. If not, you're screwed. But if you can get a reservation here, then it'll be really nice to celebrate with your family or yourself for St. Patrick's weekend. But if you're unfortunate to get the actual dining option, you have a quick service area where you could also get some of the greatest foods here too. See, look at that family. We are at Emirates because we heard they might have the Falcon and the Winter Soldier cupcakes. And I think that would be really cool if we could get one. Thank you. Thanks for coming. Mm -hmm. All right, we're in. Wow, look at these Disney cakes right off the bat. Awesome. It is here? Yeah. You see it? No, it'll be over there. Oh, okay. I'm gonna get one. Wow, I like the atmosphere in here. Very cozy. Wow, look at all these options. Oh, they don't have it Ah. All sold out? I'll get this one. And uh, I have a, a hot chocolate over there. It's a little I know, they look so shiny. I was so tempted to get it. I know. They look too perfect. It looks like glass. Look at those. And have a bunch 
bunch of cool smoothies or slushies over here. They're wine slushies. Oh, that's awesome. We just found a seat right here outside. Um, pretty cool. I'm just really hungry. <laughs> Oh man. Look at these bags. What? It's like the best hot chocolate. Oh wow. It tastes like a like a chocolate bar, just melt it and just pour it in here. <laughs> it doesn't even taste like like then you melt it in there. It's like oh wow, that sounds good now. Alright, so this is the hazelnut eclair. I think there's like little popcorn on the top. That looks really cool. Look at the napkins. I think they did. Had to check. I hope they did. That was really good. Um, I'm not gonna rank it because it's just a dessert, but besides that, it's an A plus in my book. Um, it's very fancy, rich chocolate, and I would get it again. That was a good experience, a good first experience. I'm gonna check if they have any shirts here at the World of Disney, because I've been trying to get a Disney shirt for a while. Got some live entertainment. Nice. All right, we are at the World of Disney, a 30 minute wait. We're gonna check out if that's correct. Stopwatch on, and let's see how this goes. All right, we got some line entertainment. <laughs> All right, that definitely does make it a lot easier with this huge line. Look at how far that is. And more people are coming. All right, we just passed the halfway point. Uh, we might get there under 30 minutes, what they held the sign for. We are in, and it only took 11 minutes. One third of the time they said outside. Awesome. All right, let's see what we could scout today. I see a lot of merchandise, and I'm ready to look at that. Oh, we got, we got it. We got some Falcon and the Winter Soldier merch. Oh, we even got some Black Widow merch already. So soon. Got some backpacks. Got some toys. I love Marvel a lot. So seeing a big area now, it's bigger than before, is pretty neat. Look at this Marvel sweater with a big logo in the back. I don't mind wearing that. Over here, we got some masks. Ooh, we got the Vision shirt. I haven't seen that everywhere. Another cool, hip Marvel shirt. We got some masks. Into the Star Wars area, we got some Baby Yoda stuff <laughs> immediately. We got a little Grogu. We got a stuffed Grogu. A bigger Grogu. Right next to the little Grogu. And an older Yoda. The classic. This place is really crazy. There are so many people at the place I want to go. But that's alright. Everyone is spread out. What's really cool with Disney is they even have the mask to match for your sweater. So you can even go to Hollywood Studios dressed up as Darth Vader with the whole mask and sweater completed. I think that's really neat of them. All right, just like the Darth Vader one, you have the hat to go with the Indiana shirt. Got a little projection going on here. Oh boy, we got a stitched costume right here with the hat and everything. <laughs> awesome. All right, we're gonna leave. Uh, I didn't find the shirt I wanted, but I did find a lot of cool things that I haven't seen since the last time I've been here. So that's really cool. Oh, look at that, they got some new Soul merch. Oh wow, that looks awesome. Oh, 
That looks like vice. Oh, sweet. Look at this inside hall. Really nice. Got some fancy stores. Also, the Sperry store, which I bought my first Sperry's here. They were awesome. It was for my 16th birthday. Everything here just looks so good. Like, if you want to come here and take some photos, it's definitely the place to be at because it's so vintage and, and so elegant. Planet Hollywood, my favorite restaurant of all time. Can't wait to go there again. Haven't been there in a minute. Here's the chicken guy. Kind of long line. We're actually gonna eat here today, but because of time, we didn't. But next time we do, I'm gonna get the chicken tenders with that special sauce. I see a lot of happy, very happy customers. Because every time I come here, I experience something new, whether it's the seat, the food, or the drinks. This is definitely the place you wanna go if you want the full A plus experience. All right, I think I'm gonna wrap things up right in front of this nice fountain. Thank you all for watching. If you like this video, please hit that like button. It definitely helps me a lot to hear you guys commenting and telling me how you like the vlog because that definitely does make my day. Um, if you're new here, please hit the subscribe button and I hope you all have a great day. See ya. Uh -oh.